What is up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Free Experiment. Before we jump into this video, I want to take a quick second because if not, you guys are going to be kind of confused. Um, so the footage that you guys are going to see is actually for when me and the P-Line crew, um, which is the Bass Hookup, Bearded Bassin, Cali Bassin, Infinite Bass, Live Fast Movement, uh, Greg Blanchard, Small Fry Rye, and a handful of others that I can't think off of my head. So this bait was in the works for a couple of years and lucky enough to actually be able to help prototype it and work it and add our inputs and stuff like that to make this bait a perfect bass sling machine here in California and of course out of state as well. Um, so got a big box full of them. And so this one right here, which you guys are gonna see a lot in the video, is the jaw dropper comes in a wide variety of hook sizes and weights and colors and stuff like that uh, this bait is very unique in its own way uh, it just looks like a typical swim bait head except the fact that it has a lead bill on it and you guys are thinking to yourself like you know is it like a crankbait or what no um, this bait like I said could be worked in a number of different ways you can let it sink down to the bottom and work it like a Ned Rig or a Darter Head or a Shaky Head. But this one that Bill comes into play. If you start lifting your rod up and popping it, this bait actually jumps up and starts walking like a spook, which in my opinion, just triggers a strike right there and gets those bass to really look at it and eventually they'll just come and eat it. Um, and another reason why I like this bait is when I'm working it around RIP Jig Rock, which is Tombstone Rock, Lava Rock, any rock that you look at and says, yeah, my jig's gonna get broken off first cast in there, this bait stands out. Toss it on up there, and as you're dragging it or popping it, this bill catches and it glides that up and over it. Just like that, keeping that hook actually out of there and that bait from sinking into the rock or getting hung up. I know that from experience. I've done it and it works extremely well. Um, and also just, you know, dragging on the bottom like that, like a typical Ned rig and stuff. And if you put a TRD, it lifts the ass end of the bait up like that and it just glides perfectly. Um, another way that I like to use this, which is revolutionary on its own part, is actually working this bait. Let me get the color for that. Working this bait like a spoon. I know you're thinking to yourself, Tyler, how's that possible? It's very simple and very easy and a very efficient way to catch fish. It's worked at the Muzzleload Lakes, um, Pedro, Maloney's, Tolick, uh, party it's worked at me for uh, very well and also around grass actually working on the bottom it actually comes to the grass very very well on the delta and it lakes that has a lot of grass um but back to working it like a spoon you take your favorite fluke favorite swim bait and you just drop it down and that bait's down there like that it's sitting down there perfect like this and when you pop it it does a number of different ways you do, you do a solid pop it comes up and it does a flip big old flip looks really super duper cool you can sit there and bounce it and this again starts walking like this it'll do some smaller flips just puts this bait all over the place disperses a lot of water and it catches those fish um, instead of it being like a typical spoon like a typical spoon that just solid just straight up and down up and down of course is this flutter spoon on a, um, a jigging spoon which makes a bit of a difference this bait doesn't put off a lot of flash I've tried when I actually did not have any of these in my boat actually taking just a typical darter head or a typical swim bait head by VMC and trying and dropping down and popping it the same way it does not work it doesn't get that perfect flip it doesn't get that spiral effect going down sometimes all depending on how you um, let it fall on slack line or tight line or uh, the way you pop it it's a very experimental bait that you guys should definitely try um, I'll leave a link in the description for first gen baits down there guys tackle warehouse it's where you guys got to get them these just dropped at ICAST and I promise you you guys that this coming fall season, working this bait like a spoon is going to change your life. Spot this time. Hard drive spot. And they're always right there. That's so awesome. Sir. They're here. Oh, had him already. 
Fourth time's a charm, right? Dude, this might be a good one. Yeah, this is a good one. Dude, it's giving me some gnarly head shakes. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Dude, that's a, that's a monster spot. That's a monster spot. Oh my gosh. Let me help you out with this sucker. Dude, I saw Look at this spot. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh god. Hold on, hold on. Let him go, let him go. Dude, oh my god. are you serious? <laughs> I dry swung. Dude, straight up though, huh? When it swung, dude. Oh my gosh, dude. He's, he's hooked good, dude. Don't oh. worry about it. He's, he's right through the I'm going to swing it this way. Right through the roof, dude. Right through the roof. Gosh. You said what was your PB? Uh, f <laughs> oh my god, it's that big. <laughs> so my personal best spot is 519. <laughs> Works for me. That's yours. Oh my, dude, oh that's a that's a big goodness, spot. Dude, that's a <laughs> That's gonna be that might be my biggest dude. spot. Pressure wash the carpet. If every time I get back from the. No. What is that? This has got to be a cat, dude. It's got. I dude, I ripped it. I ripped it out of the. I ripped it out of the bottom. It's gonna come and jump, dude. It was gonna come up and jump. It's not fighting like a cat. It's wanting to come up and jump, dude. But it's staying down like a cat. It's, a cat. it's not rolling though. I'm trying to bring it up to see if it's a bass or not. Let's test that fish contest. We're testing the fish contest out. Oh, no, oh, no, it's not. Oh, what's the chance of that? Really? <laughs> Dude, he's toad. Jaw dropper, boys and girls. Jaw dropper. Four thirty-five. Let's get it going, boys. Again, jaw dropper. With a little sweet beaver on it. Yeah. I've never like tried to catch one, but uh, that first corner dock by Hamilton, that was just the most insane job down there. Yeah, it ain't big. That's nah, alright. Dude, I was straight up bombing that across the rock. He came and smacked it. Hold on, I gotta flex the six pound test real fast. There you go. Six pound test. Nice. I'm a jaw dropper, baby. Right there, boys. Jaw dropper. Paired up with a little itty bitty sexy reaction innovation sweet beaver well this ain't as big as yours but on the board on the board Two. lock please two and a half nice here this bill was straight up smacking the rocks it was hopping all over it and all of a sudden the thick fish just goes boom he nailed it. 